Every time you press a button on your remote, Amazon is collecting data on your viewing habits, but the good news is you can stop it. Yo, what's up guys, it's Mystic, and today we're opening the case files on five hidden privacy settings you need to change right now to take back control of your data. First up, app usage data. So by default, your Fire Stick is sending a report back to Amazon on every app you use and how long you use it. Let's go ahead and turn that off. So you go to settings, you're gonna go down to preferences. Then once you're on this section, go to privacy settings. And then all you gotta do is go right here to collect app usage data and turn it off. And just in a simple click, that line of data collection is now closed. Now next up, we have our advertising profile. So based on the apps you use and the content you watch, Amazon builds a detailed profile on your interests to sell you targeted ads. We're gonna erase that right now. So we're gonna go to settings, preferences. We're gonna go right here to privacy settings. And then right here where it says your advertising profile, we're gonna go ahead and go here and delete it. So this is gonna delete that profile that Amazon built. And then right here, this is the most important thing. We're gonna turn it off. So we're gonna no longer get targeted ads for our device. So now let's go ahead and get to number three. So for number three is the data monitoring. So your Fire Stick is keeping track of how much internet data you use. And unless you have a very strict data cap from your provider, this is just another piece of unnecessary monitoring that can be disabled. So to turn it off, you're gonna to go to settings, preferences, and then go right here to data usage monitoring. And then here you could turn it off. And then once we do that, another layer of monitoring is now off. Now for number four, we have app permissions. And this one could be a little bit scary because some of the apps you've installed might have requested and been granted permission to access things like your microphone. So to turn that off, you go to your settings, go over here to applications. And then once you're here, go to manage install applications, then find an app that you think may be doing it like Netflix for me, I'm gonna do permissions. And right here, it has access to my files and media, which it doesn't need. So I could go right here, deny and boom. Just like that, you now take control of what the apps can do on your device. And for the final most important file, which is your voice recordings, many people don't know this, but Amazon keeps a recording of everything you've ever said to your Lex remote, and this is the biggest privacy concern of them all. Now you can't do it on the Fire Stick as far as deleting them, but if you log in online, go right here to where it says devices. And then once you're here, go to right here where it says privacy settings, you're gonna click on that. And then you're gonna click on the Alexa privacy settings. So we're gonna manage these right here. And then once you're on this screen, right here, the one that's on the top left, review voice and text history, click on that. And then right here, you'll see every single thing you've ever said to your remote or a Fire TV or even an Echo. So if you go right here, delete it, that's it. Now by default, they have it on today only. So just to show you guys, you can drop this down and you can change the all history. So by default, even if you delete it, it's only gonna be for that day. So make sure you change this and that would be it. And just like that, those are five tips to take back control of your privacy on your Fire Stick. If you guys have any questions, don't be afraid to comment, but please tell me what you guys wanna see and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.